and check out this Kids Embrace, uh, what did it say? Multi? My new Bible I saw it just a minute it. ago. It's a, it's a, it's a car seat. <laughs> but, uh, Kids Embrace, Spider-Man Marvel car seat. And it says deep headrest with EPS foam for comfort and side impact protection. Contoured seat and extra padding provide support and comfort so that your child will enjoy their ride. One-handed harness adjustment pull for snug fit. And combination booster. That's what I was looking for. <laughs> okay, are you excited? Yeah. How long have you been waiting for this car seat? Two hours. I'm pretty sure you've been waiting longer than two hours. <laughs> okay, open it up. Let's kind of scoot it away from the wall a little bit. He is so excited. Yeah, yeah I don't think you can pick it up. It's really, it's probably really heavy. <laughs> okay, watch out. Yeah. He is so excited. I'm excited. <laughs> okay, this is what it looks like. Uh, what's, what's bottom? What's, okay. So it looks like there is some assembly required. Let's open it. Hold on, let's move the box out of the way. Let's, move, let's open it. Watch out. Let's open it. Okay. I'm ready to sit on it. Well, we're going to have to put some of it together, which I don't like. Um, if you guys have watched, and <laughs> Matthew is in his bouncer right now. Hold on, baby, hold on. So if that's what you hear, yeah. But if you guys have watched my Urbini Santi car seat unboxing, there was no um, no installation required. Which honestly, this it doesn't seem like it's a big deal. Okay, hold on. Look, I'm gonna take that plastic. Move, take the plastic, baby. Grab the plastic and take it. Yep. <laughs> okay, so this is the only part that needs, back up just a little bit. This is the only part that needs to be put together. And it looks fairly easy. It's just this little post looking thing. Watch out, baby. It's just this post looking thing that needs to be fit, like pushed in here. And I'm only assuming that this is how it goes. Wait, there's cardboard. This is the part that needs to go in. And there's a Velcro part right here, which I don't really know what it's for, but. Um, Let's put it in the car. Let's put I'm it trying, in the car. Hold on, baby. Let's I'm trying to figure it. out. Okay, so. Move, move, move. Okay, there's this part right here. I don't know if you can really see it, but I think you have to push it down to make it fit in there yep because it, it goes in these little notches right here so okay come sit really quick come sit okay okay sit back can you pull me yeah up? okay so i'm gonna have to put it down some more for him so just push it in and there's a second notch okay so down one more notch Okay, so all it goes is three notches. And I, okay, hold on, get up for just a second so I can turn it around. Okay, so that's all I had to do. Um, I think that keeps that in place. All right, so here it is. <laughs> wow, let me see if I can look. This is awesome. Okay, he's playing with the box, of course. <laughs> All right. I'm out of breath. We just came back from a walk, <laughs> and this was at our doorstep, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I have to do an unboxing. <laughs> 
so it says for children whose weight is 22 through 100 pounds um, and height is 29 to 57 inches. It's a combination harness to booster car seat and it is the one, two, three, four, five point harness. Don't ask me why I just had to count that. I just, whatever. Um, and it literally says it right here. Okay, five point harness seat. Um, with harness is certified for use in motor vehicles and aircraft. So that's good if you travel. Um, this can go on an airplane. Booster car seat without harness is certified for use in motor vehicles, not for aircraft. So in order to bring this on the plane, you have to use the five point harness. Hold on. Whew. And um, of course, this is just the instruction booklet. Hold on, baby. Okay, do you want to come sit? Okay, wait, 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 wait. Get up for just a second. Oh, and John does weigh 30 pounds. And what did that say? Where's the book? 22 through 100. So he weighs 30. Okay, come on, bud. Come sit. Yep, I have to, I have to fit it to you. Okay. Okay, so you have this little silver notch right here, and what you're gonna do is just lift it up and. Okay, lift it up, and when you do, pull on the straps right here, and it, it loosens them, loosens them up. Hold on, baby. Oh, this is an airplane. Baby, we don't know where to go on an airplane. Okay, I believe the um, the point right here stays the same. I don't think it moves. I want to get out of here. You want to get out of here? You've been begging to get in it all week. Or not all week, but since about Thursday. you to fly out through the windshield so okay so I give this let me get Matt <laughs> no 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 not the box okay so John is playing with the box Matt got a little aggravated I give this car seat so far a four out of five, four out of five. I don't like the fact that assembly was required, but it's, that's, 
petty of me, you know. <laughs> um, it wasn't that hard, to be honest with you, to put that together. Um, I need to figure out how to move this center part if I can. Again, it's not really that big of a deal if these come out farther. Um, another reason why it's four out of five is because there for a minute I thought that whenever he tried to come forward, like, like sit forward, it loosened up the straps and it wasn't holding as well, you know, but I don't think that's the case. I just think that I didn't have it tight enough. Um, it feels really well cushioned, but the fabric is not the type of fabric that's super easy to, to wipe uh, liquids off of. So, if you let your children, hey, move the box, please. If you let your children eat in the car or drink in the car and say, someone gets food. Mm-hmm. Someone gets the food in the car seat or someone has an accident. Someone throws up. Um, it's going to stain it pretty bad. Now, don't ask me how to get all this off. It's Velcro. Wow. So, that part's Velcro. Okay. And this side's Velcro. Now, I don't know about any of the other stuff. Um, I don't know. It has little hooks holding it. I take it it's fairly easy to get the fabric off to wash. But yeah, the cup holders are nice. Um, I don't know if they come out, but they're nice. Hey. I love it. Hey. Um, hey. I'm in this box. Yeah. This is my home. It's quarantine time. I guess this is the perfect box to play with. You can get some crayons and color in there. So yeah, four out of five. Um, I want to get my crayons. Again, this is by Kids Embrace. And I did order this off of Amazon. So I had it like Amazon Prime here. Um, the price yeah, you is on my phone. I can't remember. I think it was like almost $130. You can? Um, specifically, I think maybe like $126. Something. So let's just say $130. But yeah. Do you like it? You do? I think Matt likes it too. All right, next up, we are gonna install it in the car and um, I'll show you guys what it looks like in the car and I will have Devin uh, bring the tripod out there and try to film the installation so you guys can see that as well. But so far, so good. <laughs> don't bite, don't bite. Hello everyone. Probably wondering what I'm doing right now on this beautiful day outside. Well, my wife wants me to put in a Spider-Man car seat and videotape it. So, because I can't cuss on this video, it's probably not going to get done right. But, happy wife, happy life. So, I'll show you how to put it in. Probably going to get a whole lot of shots of my butt. I'm sorry. <clears throat>
I'm going to pause you real quick. All right, I'm going to do this in kind of like <clears throat> broken installments, but this is more than likely what it's going to look like when you get it. So you see you got these straps that are kind of just like hooked up underneath there, one on each side. What you're going to do, you're going to pull these bad boys out. Sorry. Now you got this bad boy loosened up. Okay. Then what you're gonna do is you'll feed it right where that seat belt spot is, right there. come all the way across the other way so that's what we're looking like right now now you can unscrew this if you want but I don't think you really need to I think that'll be fine right there let me go ahead and put this all right and then uh We'll show you how it's done. I said we've got the car seat close to what it's going to be like. Now what you're going to do is you're going to take these little things. And you're going to push them in until you feel a snap. All right? So we've got one side good. And get up in here. Now there's another one right up in there. You want to make sure that that's not tangled up at all. There she is. Alrighty. Now she's not tangled up. She's in there like swimwear. Alrighty, let me set up the camera real quick and I'll show you what you need to do to get this thing tight. Alrighty, this is gonna look goofy, but it works. I know a lot of cop friends that have actually had that have done this and one of my NCOs, he actually taught me this, so just watch. You get in here and tighten it down. You want to sit up on it to make it tight. And now you're going to pull that strap. As you can see, it don't move. It don't move too much. So. Right. Let me get this. One thing I forgot to add is that they have a little back strap right here that you can kind of see. What I did was I went ahead and I looped it on behind there. And we'll do. So go to the back. I want to show off the license plate, sorry. But as you can see, there's a little strap in the back. Now, they've got these nifty little covers over the top. And as you can see, there's a little spot in the back right there. I'm going to take this bad boy. Clamp her to it. And then pull it tight. I'm gonna stop this because it's hard to tighten. I'll show you once I'm done. As I said before, nice and tight. Close this bad boy up. She's nice and in there. Alrighty, I hope this actually taught you something. Uh, it says all this stuff in the book. So, you know, recommend you read it. Uh, the only thing you do next is just put your kid in it, you know, let them be cool for a minute with the Spider-Man on, and then uh, 
you know, you want to tighten it up to your kid. I hope this was enjoyable for you and, uh, you know, be sure to go and like this video and tell my wife, thank you for making me go and videotape myself. Y'all have a good one.